Hello, hello, good people. Cyrus again here. Uh, I'm good, I'm good, I'm doing fine. I thank God for everything. He's so good, he's wonderful, he's great. Hope mkopoa, mnaedelea vizuri, na mi naedelea vizuri zaidi. Mwaka umeisha, we thank God for a beautiful year. Full of favor, full of good things. Even even though the year, the beginning of the year, for some of us like me, it was so tough, you know, it was so hard with so many ups and downs, hard times, you know. Majaribu ya likuwa umeji sana. I think, kama wakuna mtu wamejalibuwa yu mwaka, ni mimi waka ukianza, ni mepitia kwa moto fire. But even bila hata kupitia, kupitia kwa fire, I can still decree and declare that the favor of the Lord and the grace of the Lord has been so sufficient. Uh, I want to thank God because of everyone who has been supportive and supporting and everyone who has been there praying for me and those who are prayed for, may God bless you. Those who supported me financially, those who are there for me to speak a word and say something to me, may God bless you and see you through in everything. Leo, nataka kuwake kusu something. Sometimes I have a problem with the L and L. So, I don't know if you say L or L, still understand, you know. But I want to say some, talk about something today. I want to speak about faith. Imani. You know, the Bible says that without faith you cannot please God. Imani yako mwaka ukiisha. Is it that the faith that can please God, that can make God like say this? He is my son and he is pleasing me with, with his faith. This type of faith is a crazy faith I'm talking about. The faith that you can do crazy things. Try things that you have never tried. Try a business that you have never tried. And people will try to pull you down but you not accept to be pulled down because it is your faith. It is faith. It is trusting and believing in God. This is what I'm talking about today. I don't know how many of us have tried things and then they have failed and they're like, man, I can't do this anymore. Mi nataka tuamini mungu. To what level? Unaamini mungu unasema. Yani mi naamini mungu that this is gonna work. It is gonna, it's gonna work because I believe in him. I believe in God. Many of us has put, uh, we're putting our faith in people, in things. And we are not pleasing God and God gets angry and things fail and fail terribly. And some of us are doing like we are, we are copying other people's businesses or other people's dreams and, 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 and visions. And because it is not your faith, it is not your vision, it, it doesn't have God in it. So you end up failing because you never trusted God. It is, there is no faith in what you are doing. Your faith was based by what you saw with someone else. I believe and I have faith that if you have faith in you, if you believe in yourself and have faith in yourself and have faith in God, things will work. You'll please God. If you start pleasing God, then once you flourish mungu na kuwa mean that things will work, they will work and then you'll do great and great things. Your business will be successful, your idea you will be successful. Don't allow people to bring you down. And I keep on saying this many times. Usikubali watu wakurudishe chini. Don't allow that to happen. Just trust God. Amini Mungu. Amini Jehovah. Just trust God. Amini that our Father who art in heaven, Emmanuel, God with us, will be there for you. Our Father, Jehovah Jireh, Nis, El Shaddai, Shama, he will be there for you. It is high time that the year is ending. I don't know how your year is ending. Some of us have good times. Some of us have bad times as the year is ending. Some of us are going through a very hard time. And all in all, I will say one thing. And I will encourage you and tell you that God will always be there for you. All you need is to trust Him. All you need is to believe in God. All you need is to have faith and believe that God will make everything possible for you. Just love God. You know, in, in, the Bible says in the book of in the book of Proverbs, Proverbs 35, Proverbs, I think, 8, 35 or something like that. In the book of Proverbs, I can't remember the chapter very well. It says that those people who hate me, they love death. And those people who hate God, they love death. It's a high time you start loving God and you hate, you're going to hate death. But those people who hate God, 
they grave death. There are people who just hate God, you know, because things are not working for them and they believe it is God who is making everything worse for them. No, you have to love God unconditionally and believe and trust in Him and have faith that He's the one who makes everything possible. So, remember, those people who hate God, they love death. And those who people who love God, they will live and they have a beautiful life. Trust in God. Have faith. I encourage you. Do things your way. Do things the way that you think they should be done. Have faith in God. Do things that are unique. Start something unique. Believe in yourself and God will make everything possible. Have a beautiful day and may God love you. May God do great things for you. May God heal you. Those who have diseases, mungu awaponye. When you napitia kwa shida, mungu watoe kwa shida. When you wameshiwa na nguvu, mungu, mungu wape nguvu. When you hawana imani, mungu wape imani. When you wame kosa marafiki, wame nyimwa rana marafiki na watu wa familia. Mungu wape rana na mungu wapende na mungu wawonjeshe ula. Mapenzi ambayo haya na mwisho. May God give you that love that has is endless, you know. Those people who have no fathers and have no parents, he is the father to the father that is. The, the same Bible says so. So remember that God will be there for you. As the year ends, may God be there for you and may God love you and show you love. He is Emmanuel. He is everything. Love you and have a good time.